G'day, hello. It's not like me to talk, but here I am talking. I've just been watching a tutorial by Renderbucket. Uh, link will be in the description. And, uh, oops, excuse me. What we're looking at is neural rendering. It's a really quick and easy tutorial. Um, and I'm excited, basically. Uh, I really enjoy tinkering with post-processing. Let's have a look what's going on. First things first, you need to, uh, of course, this is a plugin, neural rendering plugin has been activated. And as a result, down in your material options, we now have a neural profile that can be created. Okay, let's take a look at the neural profile. It's pretty simple. And there you go, you can associate the model data to your profile. So the, the model data is linked in Render Bucket's original video. I'll also put a link in the description just to save you some time if you don't want to jump to the excellent tutorial by our great friend Render Bucket. All right, so I've associated uh, one of the model models there. Let's have a look on GitHub. Uh, Opset version 9 is recommended by Render Bucket. I haven't tampered with 8. No point if it's uh, known to cause some errors. Look at all my tabs. All right. Then we need to create just a regular material. But as Render points out, we need to make it a post-process. And ooh, I can't remember what else we did. That's why you need to watch the video links in the description uh, so I'm, I'm, I'm not going to go through why you have to divide renders worked it out for you using this data set uh, you can see from here we've got a new neural input and a neural output okay go into my level I've added a post process and in the materials Okay, we've associated our new material to it. Now hopefully, uh, you'll have to excuse my machine is pretty poor. Let's hope it doesn't crash on us. No, looking good so far. Okay. Let's have a look. It's somewhere down here. There we go. So I'm not going to go to the ins and outs about the quality and where we go from here. Uh, I'm just very excited that we can train models. Yeah. Oh. What's going on? Love it. Very interesting. While we're at it, let's have a quick look. Uh, maybe we could um, try a different model. Um, shall we go for pointillism? There we go. Let's save it. Let's go back in. Who would it be? Sorry, I'm starting a bit far back. It gives us a chance to play with this new stuff. Ooh, that's a bit. So as you can see, nothing perfect here, but uh, for me, this is an exciting development. Uh, I use a lot of post-process and got no issues with the traditional you know, ways of doing it, but uh, yeah, this should be a very interesting um, development in the future that I'll be keeping track of. Should we do one more? Let's do one more. I haven't tried mosaic, I don't think. Have I tried mosaic? Don't think so. 
So once again, render bucket, thank you for all your trouble uh, shooting. Time spent. Ooh, pretty. This is a one renders using in the video. Uh, intriguing. Anyway, that's me. Thanks for putting up with my commentary, and uh, may all be well.